morning YouTube. Um, this is a little Adventures with Cooper. <laughs> Let me zoom in on him. Little Tinker with his ball. Um, sorry about my camera not being very clear. However, there's quite a lot of mist this morning. It's a typical late summer day. Um, we were up till really late last night. As you know, I'm looking after the farm and got all the haylage baled. And as I said, there's nearly 200 acres here. So um, we were out till late with the contractors. Come on, Coops. Um, because we had, there were some horses in the bottom field, the three horses, they were like right the way down here. And obviously they had to bail and get through. So we had to get the horses, bring them up to the top, put them in one of the small fields, which is actually a winter grazing field, full of grass. Um, until the contractors had finished and they should have been finishing at four o'clock. 10 o'clock last night, we were in the pitch fucking black, uh, trying to lead horses down here um, with, a, with a torch. That was fun. <laughs> but um, it's all done now. All they've got to do is come back for the bales. I mean, there's a load in the bottom field. They've moved some of them, but... There are still one, two, three, four, five, uh, six, seven fields that have got, uh, I mean, this this is quite a small field with these uh, six bales in it, but the rest of them are huge fields, well, you'll, you'll see now. Um, I mean, this is the second cut of the year, so, because it has been a good summer. I mean, it ended up very, very wet um, towards the end of the summer. Um, you know, we started off really nicely and then it ended up very wet, so it were a bit crap. These are the, these are the horses. Uh, well, I'll see what, oh, there they are, the two, and their field goes all the way down there. The contractors broke the gate the other day, which is right at the, you can probably just see it in the centre of the screen behind this horse. And it leads into another field down there, which they've gone and um, done a cut on, but the contractor smashed the gate. So I wish you'd have seen there were three of us trying to make some form of a um, a jerry job of <laughs> fixing the gate. But, um, I mean, it's 6am here. and This is my favourite time of year. I love it. Harvest time. Um, I've been... All the bushes, as I said, there are 200 and odd acres, so all of the bushes are laden with blackberries. There are hazelnut trees, um, there are sloes. So I have been coming down doing a little bit of pilfering um, every day. Um, I mean, I've been stripping these hedges, but the, the blackberries are gigantic. Um, well, they have been gigantic. They're not so, I can't really see so many on this one because I, I absolutely stripped that bush the other day. Um, I mean, there are more coming out because obviously the big juicy ones. Um, I mean, the, these on this side aren't as big as the ones I've been pulling off, but they were like the size of plums, massive. Um, there's also a huge damson tree, so I've been told I can help my effing self to that one as well. So guess who's going to be making lots of alcohol? Pies, crumbles, cakes this year. Um, oh, what are you doing, Coops? Where's your ball? Where's your ball gone? Go get it. Where's your duck duck? Oh, silly. Give it to me and I'll throw it. Give it, put it down. Good boy. Just give the dog a lunch. Oop. I mean, there are red deer down here as well. We saw one the other day. Um, I don't know what he'd do. Normally, he's quite used to the um, the roe deer and the seeker deer, which aren't as big. He's not, he's not actually seen a red deer. <laughs> well, he's seen him in the distance, but he hasn't seen them to chase, so that would be quite interesting. So, yeah, it looks like it's going to be another hot day. It got to 30 degrees again yesterday. Absolutely bloody boiling. Um, but, you know... I shouldn't complain. So anyway, that's uh, Cooper and I. First thing in the morning, doing the rounds of the farm before I have to feed the cattle and the goats and got all his cats. 
and the horses come on like i said got two ex-police horses here as well um so yeah it's it's lovely so we really like it on here me and Maisie um she wants a little friend she hasn't got a little friend at the minute but she her little field she's got a field of her own she's in between um the police horses on one side and then there's the neighbor's horses their field actually butts up to, to hers so the next door neighbor um and she's got two beautiful beautiful um sport horses and one of them has taken a bit of a shine to Maisie it's like 20 times bigger than her but he's taken a shine so yeah um so hello to those of you who aren't in England just showing a little bit of uh, Lancashire farming life so I hope you all have a fantabulous day see you later bye right these are the goats I'll probably get attacked now because I've got to get the buckets out oh here she comes no go away peanut and Hattie don't butt me because you keep doing it and it hurts Oop, let me just get this gate sorted right okay Hattie Okay, Peanut, they're the babies. These are two South African goats. There's Big Eddie over there. Whoop! When I bring them in, Hattie, the big one, the mum, she bloody comes bouncing. Boing, 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 bang. Straight, she's at me up the arse three times this week. That didn't sound right, but you know what I mean. <laughs> she's, um, oh, here we go. Peanut! <laughs> you doing? Now these were rescued from the abattoir. They were going for meat. So you'd think you'd be grateful, wouldn't you, you little rat bag? Don't come butting me just because I'm going to turn me back on you. Whee! Go on, bugger off, go on. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> Welcome to my life. <laughs> there you go. Can't believe Daisy's not getting up. Look at this one, this is Bluebell. All right, Bluebell, here, come here. You have all of them. There you go. Oh, you're a good girl, aren't you? <laughs> you could do a still off this and then have it on your wall, couldn't you? How? You just bit my finger, you fucker.